Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to download Optifine and install some shader packs that um, cause very little lag in your world. Um, so yeah, make sure to subscribe, press the like button, and turn on the notification bell if you're new, because that would help me out a lot. And um, let's get right into the video. <laughs> Now, the shader pack that I'm going to be linking is not mine, and I don't know whose it really is, but I'm going to have a link in the description to this guy's video, his name's C. Bruce. I've subscribed to him, and he's a really nice guy, and he's the one that made this video first, but I felt like I wanted to share it more by making another video of it so more people can find it, and it'll just help more people out. So yeah, if you want to go see his video, um, link will be in the description to his video and to that shader pack that I'm going to be using when I get Optifine on. Okay, so the Optifine link will be in the description, so you're going to want to press on that. Now, after you press on that, you should be on a page that looks like this right here. Um, so as you can see, it says Optifine Home Downloads Donate Cape Login FAQ. You're going to want to press Downloads right here next to the Home button, okay? Now that you've pressed Downloads, it should say, it depends which version you're in. Right now it says Minecraft 1.14.4. Now what you're going to want to do is press Preview Versions right here at the top. It's right above the Minecraft 1.14.4. And right now, the very top one, you're going to want to download the very top one, it's Optifine 1.15.2 HD UG1 Pre 12. Now, it can be different from you, as in Z Bruce's video, it was Pre 10, but mine's just Pre 12. It doesn't really make a difference. So, then you're just going to want to press download. Just press download right on the download, and then it's going to bring you to a page that's literally just full of ads. Do not press anything on this page. It's going to have a button up here, it's going to count down from like 5 or something like that, and you're just going to want to press the skip button, nothing else. After you've pressed the skip button, it'll bring you to a page like this, and what you're going to want to do is press download preview, and what mine is, mine is download preview Optifine 1.15.2 HD UG1 pre12.jar. Do not press on any of these ads, just press on the download. It's going to want to download it, and I'm just going to press save as, and I'm just going to download it to the desktop and save. And just like that, it's on my desktop. So what you're going to want to do now is press on it, double click on it, it brought it over here. But as you can see right here, you're going to want to press install, and all it's going to do is it's going to install it to my .minecraft, which is my Minecraft folder. So you press install, and it brought over a little thing right here, and it says Optifine is successfully installed. So you're going to press OK. And now, okay, so you have Minecraft up. Now what you're going to want to do is go over to installations. Make sure you already have the release, the latest release, 1.15. Make sure you have that up, and you've already been on it once. So if you haven't been on it once, just click on it, go to the menu, and then just close it, and then get right back to this launching screen. So now you're going to go to installations new and then press version and then press release 1.15.2 optifine hd ug pre 12 or whatever yours says or whatever snapshot yours is so yes then you just press this I'm just gonna name it optifine uh what can i change it to i'll put it to a diamond block because it's so great there you go that's up press play now that you're on minecraft you're going to going to press you're going to want to press single player or multiplayer whatever you want to go on i'm going to create a new world just for the purpose of this okay now that i'm in the world which i really like how the grass block fully covers that but that ain't the point of this okay now that i'm in the world you're going to want to press f3 and if you look at the very very top left hand corner it says Minecraft 1.15.2, 1.15.2, dash, Optifine, 
underscore HD underscore U G1 underscore pre 12 slash vanilla. And that means that you have Optifine enabled. And I have the button set to already zoom in as one of my mouse buttons. But that is how you do it. So yeah, uh, let's get right into that. So what you're going to want to do is press your pause button, go to options right here, go to video settings, and then see it says shaders. Make sure you have fast render to off, which, hold on a second, I got to find that. So if you want to know where it is, it's in performance, you go to performance, and then it says fast render, you have to have that set to off, apparently. Yep, and then you can come right in here, and you have your shader packs. Okay, go to your pause menu again, then go to options, go to video settings, go to shaders, and then press open shaders folder. I just made my game not full screen for a second, so I could open it without it um, closing Minecraft. So, shaders folder, you're going to press that, and as you see, it brought up to this little screen, which is the ones I have. I'm going to actually delete that one. But these are the shaders that I have right here, as you can see, Apex, Apex, the wave, the wave, which is that really trippy one. So I'm going to have one down in the description that you can download, and I will show you how to put it in it. Okay, you're going to want to press the link, and then you're just going to come over here and press download. It's going to say something like this, your download will be in four seconds. Don't press anything, just wait for it to pop up. Press save as, and I'm going to save it to my desktop again, and save. Okay, so I copied it to my desktop, and this is it right here, and here's Minecraft. So you're going to want to put it into the shader pack folder that we just opened up by pressing this button right here. You're going to want to put it in there, and see, it popped up. So now you can close that, pop up Minecraft, I'm going to make it full screen again. Okay, now it's full screen, and you're just going to press on that, and it loads the shader pack. It seems to be lag free and it looks really nice it actually looks really nice and you can see your shadow so yes this is going to be the end of this video um if you enjoyed press the subscribe button the like button and the notification bell make sure you go sub to z bruce because i'm making this video to spread the word like he did to me and yeah that's gonna be pretty much it see you guys in the next one Bye bye